Hi, I'm Bob Singer, and that's me with the incredibly cheesy grin. I'm a master youth coach. Yes, I know that sounds quite fancy, but what it really means is I'm a nerd about coaching, especially for and by young people. So many people nowadays are confusing coaching with mentoring. In fact, there are many misconceptions and misunderstandings about what coaching is. There are people speaking about a coaching relationship and calling it mentoring. And there are others that are doing mentoring but calling themselves a coach. Let's face it, nowadays calling yourself a coach or a mentor is pretty fashionable. But it's important to know the difference, especially when working with and for young people. So let me put the record straight right here right now coaching is not mentoring now I know that this sounds obvious but if you take one thing away from this session let it be this although they are similar they're not the same for me mentoring is the transfer of expertise and or experience so for example if I were a carpenter and I were looking for a mentor I'd look for a carpenter with more or different expertise and or experience than me the outcome being that via a dynamic and powerful relationship I would gain some of that expertise and or experience if I were a new business owner and I wanted a mentor I'd look for someone with even more expertise and experience than me in running a business the key words being, as you may have guessed, expertise and experience. But mentoring is not coaching. Because a coach doesn't necessarily need to have an expertise or even experience in the subject on which the coaching is on. Coaching, in my opinion, is the asking and answering of questions that raise awareness and prompt growth. Unlike a mentor, a coach's intention is not to transfer expertise, experience, guidance or wisdom. In fact, a coach very rarely, if ever, gives advice or tips. So what does a coach do? I think a coach focuses on skillfully crafting questions which propel the client forward towards their desired outcome. Skillfully crafting questions which propel the client forward towards their desired outcome. A coach can help you become really clear about three things. Those three things are one, what you want, your goal your outcome, your end in mind. Two, where you are in relation to your goal, how far or how near. And three, the best strategy for you so that you can move forward towards your goal. A coach does this by skillfully asking questions which raise your awareness about what's going on, about what's needed and help you design your own solutions solutions especially designed by you to fit your life your world and your style of doing things in mentoring a relationship in a mentoring relationship the mentee or client asks more questions whereas in a coaching relationship the coach asks more questions in a mentoring relationship the mentor has the answers in a coaching relationship the client has the answers a mentor is not me is a mentor is not better than a coach or vice versa but they are different so can you be a coach and a mentor at the same time well my answer is yes but it's very important to know when you are doing what and it's even more important that your client knows the difference. Mentoring and coaching share many essential skills like building trust and rapport. And rapport, as we know, is the fundamental ingredient in all effective relationships and is vital in both coaching and mentoring. 
my advice is when you need a specialist to give you advice guidance and tips based on their experience and expertise in a specific area get a mentor and when you need a specialist to help you get really clear on what you want and help you design personalized solutions which propel you forward based on their skill of asking the right questions in the right way at the right time then get a coach a great mentor is committed to gaining even more expertise and experience in his or her chosen field and skills on how to transfer that to someone else a great coach improves by developing his or her skills of crafting questions actively listening and developing powerful rapport so in summary mentoring is the transfer of expertise and or experience and coaching is the asking and answering of questions that raise awareness and prompt growth coaching and mentoring are not the same they are they have different outcomes require different skill sets and serve different purposes they are both valuable and useful coaching and mentoring are similar but not the same thanks for watching if you found this useful you can find more videos like this at iloveyouthwork.com